this is a hypnosis for decision making. Let's go ahead and start the relaxation process. Find the most comfortable spot to sit or lay down. Your hands and feet need to not be crossed and laying or sitting relaxed. Go ahead and breathe in and breathe out feeling so comfortable and so relaxed. As you breathe in, scan your body and focus on any spot that you have stress or tension from the day and breathe out, letting go of this. This may be in your brow, neck, shoulders, back, or legs. Let any stress or tension go and relax more and more. Go ahead and focus on the top of your head and forehead and become more and more relaxed. You feel a wave of relaxation that is so calm and so comforting. You feel this in all of the muscles of the face and your eyes and eyebrows, your lips and jaw. You take a deep breath and your neck and shoulders are loose and limp like a rubber band feeling so flexible and calm. Now go ahead and focus on your chest and lungs as you breathe in and out, you are relaxing more and more and your relaxation can double and double with each and every breath. You can focus on your stomach and it feels so soft and relaxed. So soft and relaxed. And the relaxation goes to the arms and forearms, to the hand, and to each finger and the fingertips. You may even feel a tingling sensation in the fingers. You feel the wave of relaxation through the whole top part of your body. And as you breathe in, you feel the relaxation go to your hips and thighs and the lower half of your body is feeling so loose and limp. You breathe in and out 
as your relaxation is doubled and doubled and is more and more. The knees and calves have a wave of relaxation and your relaxation doubles. You feel the relaxation in your feet and toes as a wave of relaxation has gone throughout your whole body. Your whole being is so loose and limp and calm and relaxed. Go ahead and focus on your breathing. A few breaths in and out so you can begin to focus on the learnings you are going to have in this state of relaxation and trance. You want to encourage making internal decisions. You want to encourage making internal decisions so you can act before any external circumstances interfere. A friend of mine recently went through an experience that really taught them such a valuable experience for them on many different levels for their life. He wanted to get a new job so he could much more easily support him and his family. He wanted a job. He wanted one that paid him lots more and had a prestigious title. He applied for a job and this involved moving to another city that was pretty far away. He wanted this so badly, but was a bit uncertain about moving to make things happen. So he asked the company if he could take a week to think about this. He wanted to take a week to decide. The company agreed and allowed him this time to make the decision. They thought he was a deserving candidate for the prestigious position. He went back and forth for a week and his feeling kept going back and forth more and more. He thought to himself what a wonderful opportunity this would be for him and his family. The company called him a week later, so obviously they were more than interested in him. He responded that he wanted three more days to think about it. And when they called him three days later, he asked if he could have another day to decide. And they agree again that he could have a day to decide. The company called him the next morning and asked for his answer and he asked if he could tell them later that day. And they told him right then and there, they gave the job to someone else, someone that was much more enthusiastic about the job and opportunity
This friend of mine was upset because he wanted this job, but he made himself afraid. He was thinking of doing too many things at once, instead of knowing he could move and work and live one day at a time. There is always an appropriate time to take action, whether it is small or massive action, before the chance slips away. An opportunity is not going to go away completely, but it is going to go to someone else. This message shows that my friend was overwhelmed with all that was involved. The moving, his family, the decision, fear of the unknown possibly. He has now learned not to focus on these aspects and to focus on what he can gain by choosing happiness and making great choices for his life. Now go ahead and breathe in and out and use this moment to think of a conflict that you may have in your life. A conflict where you need to decide something for yourself. You know that this could be a problem, something that you think each way part of the time. Part of the time you want to go for it, and another part of the time you are unsure and decide differently. Go ahead and notice what it would be like to go for it and imagine this image on your hand of what would be there. Go ahead and get a visual of what you would have if you go for it. What would you see? What would you hear? What would you feel? Be very specific. You may see a close friend or family member or a spouse. Or it could be something you always wanted. Does this sound like someone you would know? Go ahead and have a clear picture of this and separate the intention you have from any of the behaviors that may be holding you back part of the time. Take a few moments to do this and think of the crystal clear intention. Think to yourself, what is the intention? Would you be fulfilled? Would you be happy? For what purpose does this have for you? Would this have long lasting success? Would it make you feel complete? What would this do for you? What does that make you do? Or how does this make you feel? Go ahead and take a deep breath and go deeper 
and deeper and think about all of the intention and purpose and what this could do for you and what this could make you do or how this would make you feel. Now you notice that this crystal clear intention has become something that you want to do. You know nothing can hold you back. You know your intentions are pure. You know the great things it will do for you and the success you are going to have. You know the purpose this brings to you and to others you can help. You know exactly what you need to do and how wonderful this makes you feel. Your life can become totally whole and totally complete and totally integrated. Your life is totally whole from making these types of decisions. Your life is totally complete when you decide and do the right thing. Your life is totally integrated with long lasting success when you choose happiness and make great decisions. You have feelings of happiness, success, calmness, peacefulness, and relaxation. You have crystal clear intentions for your life. You have purpose in your life. You know what success can do for you. You know what choosing the right decisions makes you feel. You are an action taker and you are living your authentic and true life that you want. You work through any resistance and you choose success and happiness. You are the best version of yourself. Go ahead and focus on your breathing and think about how you have learned to become totally whole, totally complete, and totally integrated with everything that you do.
In a moment, I'm going to count up from one to five and you are going to reorient to the room. One, you begin to have feeling in your fingers and toes. Two, you are so whole, so complete, and so integrated. Three, you have learned to decide what is best for you all of the time. Four, it feels as if your eyes have been bathed in cool, clear, natural spring water. Five, open your eyes and notice how whole, complete, and integrated your life is with being the best you can be.